Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode, and today I am going to use some of this rainbow soap, and I'm going to, it's hard to see, but I'm going to use it, and I'm going to carve something out of the soap, since it's kind of like clay. And this is really messy, and I have it on a little Christmas tray. And I have tons of paper towels. So let's get started. I have these plastic tools too that could help. My grandma may come in, but that's only because she's just taking the dog out. And first, we get it wet. So make sure you have your sleeves up. This will only be for 15 minutes, and it might be a part 2 episode. Since it can only be done for like 14 minutes, so I hope we get it done. So once this is all ready, it's like really clay and very moldable. Don't get worried about getting your hands dirty because that's how you know you're having fun. So I'm just going to see if I can roll it into a little ball. It's cleaning my hands while I'm molding it up so it's it's soap. Then see. And my hands are really shiny. You could tell through the camera. They're really shiny, but you can't see that much color. So now I'm going to see if I could grab some things to sculpt it. I'm going to use a fork and a knife. But not a real knife. Don't use real knives without a parent's help. And I'm a kid, and I don't have a parent's help, and I'm scared of knives. So I'm going to cut it in half. And on the inside, it's really dry, so I'm going to get my hands wet again and rub that in. I want two balls from this. I'm going to rub up the support and make them into two balls. I don't know if you can hear it, but it sounds really weird. They look just like shiny red balls through the camera that you're seeing. Don't be inappropriate because some kids in my school laugh at that. And if you're young enough to not know what it means, don't, don't worry about it. You'll find out when you get older. But this is it. And I'm going to use just one of them to help sculpt. I'm going to flatten it down. I'm going to grab some more water, since it seems like it's getting dry. It seems like it's getting dry. Just use more water. I'm going to flatten it. Make sure that it's completely smooth, maybe some fingerprints, and it's really slippery for me. I'm going to do tons of art channels because I love art and crafts. Have any idea of a craft? Tell me. In the comments below, and there we go. And it's really messy. I'm happy I'm using a tray right now. And I grab back the knife. It's really hard to grip since my hands are slippery. The paper towels just fell, and I guess I'll grab them later. But right now, I'm just firstly gonna gently make what I want my design to look like. And since it's red, and Valentine's Day is coming up. I'll make it look like a red heart. They're not going to be too big, but they're going to be adorable. And you could even give it to a Valentine's for Valentine's Day. To like a friend that like likes soap.
Right now I'm just carving out a little heart. No, I am done, but I kind of messed it up, but... Okay, I guess I'll start it over. We still have, t still have like, nine more minutes to go, so don't worry. This might be boring, so you could just skip to the end. Unless if you want to see how to make it and see me making it. And if you make a mistake, you could just rub it in. Which is what I like about it. So let's just make the heart. Bring it down here and curve this. Rub this side in. Done, so now I'm going to use the knife to gently cut around the shape I made. Let's just turn this over and there we go. It's time though. Good. And now I'll just make sure I cut through it without harming the design. To gently cut. Now, very carefully take away all of the access. And I need more water. Now there we go. Now I'm going to use the fork very gently to gently scoop it up. It may mess up a few times, but just keep trying. If you keep on trying, soon you'll get it. Be really careful because it feel terribly wrong and wait. I'll show it to you. It may not look perfect, but it's okay. See? And now it's a lovely little heart. And I'm going to put it on the mat for it to dry. And turn into a heart shape so so I'm gonna see if I can make one more thing before I end the episode because we don't have very long we have about five more minutes so let's get this ready you probably need more water this needs to be as watery as it can be and here we go Now I'm going to flatten it, and I'm going to smooth it out with a little more water. And my grandma's coming back, so I'll probably hear the door open. And I'm going to make a, a circle.
just turn this over. So we're working, looking circle, but it's a good one. Good enough anyway. And here it is. So I'm probably going to end the episode here. So goodbye. I gotta go wash my hands. Bye.